to get here to Piedmont to check on things and we're finding lots of good news. The lights are on, power's on. We haven't seen any damage. We do want to report to you about BART. We've got a shot of the MacArthur BART station for you. Want to tell you about what they do when something like this happens. It's standard procedure. They do check the tracks for damage and that does create a bit of a delay. They have already finished that inspection. Everything looks good. Trains are running. So what we've most noticed about this earthquake is that people did feel it. It was strong enough to uh, to jolt people and also knock a few things around. I was already getting up, uh, taking a friend to the airport and uh, a cymbal fell down in my drum set in the music room set. That sort of woke me up and uh, yeah, I felt some shaking. I was brushing my teeth. So, <laughs> How did you react? I said, oh, oh, yeah, I stopped for a minute and thought, oh no, are we going to have the big one with all this wet weather, the ground's moving? But it wasn't, so everything's still in place. And here's a look inside Mulberry's Market in Piedmont. As you see, everything is still in place. Always a good place to check to see if anything got knocked off the shelves. Wine bottles still standing. Everything looks good inside. So the biggest side effect this morning is probably going to be a little lack of sleep for people in this area who uh, got an early alarm clock this morning in the form of this earthquake because it did hit at 442 this morning.